Hello viewers, today we are solving question on relative frequency. The question we have today is find the relative frequency of these data. And the data is the number of cup of coffee taken by students in a day. So we have the information given to us here. I want to present this information using the relative um, frequency. So by doing this here, we have the number of cups in this question, we're going to use the single value approach, which is known as the ungrouped data. Okay, so the minimum um, number of coffee taken in a day by student is zero, while the maximum is four. So on this, under this cup of coffee, I'm going to present the information that is zero, one, two, three, and um, four. Okay, so. Now, I'm going to work on the frequency, that is, the number of occurrence. So, working on the frequency, let's see how many zeros do we have. Let's count together. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And here we are having 5 zeros. How many 1 do we have? Let's count together. 1, 2, 3, Four. We are having four. That shows that we have four students that takes coffee only once. Okay. So how many students takes coffee twice? So how many two do we have? We have one, two, three, four. Also, so I'm having four. What about three? Let's see. We're having one, two. Okay, then we have two. We have about four. Four times, we're having one, two, three, four, and um, five. So what is the total? Okay, five plus four plus four plus two plus five is going to give me 20. Okay, now, um, once we calculate the relative frequency, the formula for calculating the relative frequency is the frequency of each of the categories over the total. Okay? So, in this category here, what is the frequency? I'm having 5. What is the total? The total is what? 20. So, it is going to be 5 over 20. Okay? So, 5 over 20 is the same thing as 0. 25. So in percentage, we have what? 25%. What about the second one here? We are having 4, right? Which is the frequency over total, which is 20. Okay? So here, I'm having what? 0 0.2. Okay? So which is what? 20%. Okay? Here, I'm having 4 also, which is the same thing. Mm -hmm. This is going to give me what? 0 0.2, which is the same thing as 20%. And the third one here, I'm having 2. Over 20. This is the same thing as what? 0 0.1, which is 10 percent. Okay. Lastly, I'm having 5. Yeah, it's going to be 5 over total, which is 20. And here, I'm going to have what? Which is the same thing as this, 0 0.25, which is 25 percent. And there's one thing about um, relative frequency is that after doing it, you must make sure that the percentage sum up to 100. If your percentage is not up to 100 or more than 100, that means there's a mistake somewhere. So now let's sum this up. 25 plus 20 gives 45, plus 20 gives 65, plus 10 gives 75, plus 25. Here we have 100%. 
So, this is how to calculate relative frequency. Thank you very much for watching my videos. If you find this video very useful, click on the like button and also subscribe to this channel. See you next time. Bye.